South, South Carolina, Carolina tees up the ball as we get ready for the opening kickoff. Excellent kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The quarterback brings his troops out onto the field for the first drive of the game. They go with the runner. He's taken down behind the line. I think sometimes offenses forget to even include corners as defenders and tacklers because a lot of corners just want to be out there and playing against the pass. But this is a corner that they have got to be responsible and remember in the future that he's got to be involved in being able to come up with a blocking scheme. This time they just let him go, and he's athletic and strong enough to come up and make a play. Throws it in a hurry, and they make the stop at the 28-yard line. And Kirk, that was a nice grab there. You know, it may be simple, but whenever you can gain solid yardage, you're doing something right. From their own 28-yard line, Third down. Green Scrambling around. They bring him down. This quarterback has to do a better job of avoiding the rush because sacks can be real drive killers. So no luck on that drive as they go three and out. And this one is a beauty. <laughs> South Carolina staff and their fans have heard all week long their quarterback's going to play terribly on the road. I think their staff's got them ready to prove them wrong right now. I, I think this staff really has rallied this entire team around some of that negative talk. And I think they believe in their guy that he can go on the road and make the plays and lead them to a big victory. Uh, you know, sometimes when you hit some adversity like that, you see teams circle the wagons. And I, and I really believe this week they've done a great job of doing that. Now they just have to go out and execute the plan and go out and win this game. Second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 31-yard line. He's on the run. Tackle at about the 43-yard line. This is a pretty tough guy, and he's a great leader. He's going to do whatever it takes to help his team. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. That's a team of four. That makes it second and six. Second down and six. Ball on their own 47. Three down, three down. Here we go, here we go. Pressure coming. And they get the sack. You can't take sacks like that as a quarterback. He just can't. If you can't find a receiver, get out of the pocket and throw the ball away. down and they need to get it inside the 47. Really one of the very tough places to play in college football and it's no different today. And they got him and that'll get him fired up. Well, this offense is running plays that are taking way too long to develop giving the defense plenty of time to get after the quarterback. And boy they're putting a lot of pressure on him. Doesn't look like he's going to have much time to get rid of this punt. He gets it away, and this is a really nice punt. Decent effort. He's not the type of guy to call a fair catch very often. He does have the ability to make guys miss. And so far, it's been totally even. In close games like this, every possession is likely to matter. Here's a run. He's knocked out of bounds at about the 41. Very well designed play that time to give him a first down. The linemen executed their blocks nicely and it went for a good game. From their own 41 yard line, first down. And down he goes at 
the 49. You know what? After a play like that, I wouldn't be the least bit surprised if they went to the air again. Steps out of bounds at the 48. From the 48-yard line, it's first down. They'll drop him for a loss. Well, you can really mess with an offense's game plan if you can take away their ability to run. That'll bring up second and 11. Man left, man left. Four down, four down. Check, check back 11, check back 11. Red 2X. Motion, motion, motion. Here we go. Just throws this one away. Third down now, and they need to get it down to the 38. Three down, three down. Hey, check, check back 11, check back 11. Red 2. <laughs> He launches one for the end zone. Brad, I just think this quarterback's got to do a much better job of being able to read that defense and make quicker decisions. And especially when the defense starts to get pressure, you've got to either get rid of that football or check it down or take off and run with it. Booming kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Alabama's loving this crowd support, and they get it week in and week out. Well, that's one thing they can count on every single time they play in this stadium is creating an environment that's going to allow them to play with an edge on defense. Great start to this game. Now let's see if they can just continue that. He's got an opening. They'll bring him down right around the 30. And he has a huge run. I'll tell you right now, this guy is arguably one of the fastest players in college football today. There you see him turn it upfield with such fluidity and quickness. And he's taken down around the 27-yard line. Second down and 14. Ball on the 27. Hey, watch the ball, watch the ball. Ball, 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 ball. He steps out around the 40 yard line. Game number 10 on the play. That'll bring up third and inches. Right and left, right and left. Right and the intimidation factor is definitely here when you're playing in this stadium. And he's tackled right around the 46-yard line. That's good for a gain of 14 yards. From the 46-yard line, first, first down. Mike Sick, 33, 33. Gets rid of it quickly. And that one's incomplete. Number 22, the intended receiver on the play. That makes it second and 10. Empty backfield, quarterback in the gun. Five wide receivers. And a quick throw. Tackle made at the 34-yard line. First down. From the 34-yard line. First down. He's scrambling. He's taken down right around the 24-yard line. That's good for a game of 10 yards. And this is the eighth play of the drive. Tight right, tight right. Three down, three down. Watch 14, watch 14. Black five, black five. Check red back seven, three. red seven. We played one. Now this one's scoreless. Back to the action now here in the second quarter. Dog four. He's going to try and scramble. And that sets them up for the first and goal. Well, that's another first down, Brad. That's the fifth first down on this drive. You know, they're, they're, this offense isn't hitting a lot of big plays, but they're very, very consistent with their execution. It's putting a lot of pressure right now on this defense. 
It's first down, and they'll be looking for six points here. Three down, three down. Mark six. And he is drilled at the eight-yard line. This is the tenth play of this drive. Tackles him hard at the five. This is from the five yard line. It's third and goal. Now he tries to buy some time, and he's going to be sacked. Loss of six yards on today. That brings us fourth and goal. South Carolina is looking to go up by three. He gets it up, and it sails through the uprights. Even though they gave up a field goal here, that defense is feeling pretty good about themselves right now. It could have just as easily been a touchdown. They line up to kick this one away. He just drills this one. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. He's tackled at the 21. The D-line did a good job of nullifying out the blocks up front, and that allowed the linebacker to roam free and make the tackle in the backfield. So it's second and 14. Ball on their own 21. Hey, check, check Mike, 11. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Orange and Tackled after a decent pickup. They couldn't hook up on that one. That's going to bring up fourth down. The offense really had nowhere to go on that one. The play was very well defended, and now the incompletion will force the fourth down and a punt. Oh, excellent punt. He's tackled at the 36-yard line. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. South Carolina has a three-point lead. He scrambled. Brought down right around the 44-yard line. That's good for a gain of eight yards. That brings us it's second down now, and they're just a few feet away from that first down marker. Watch 23, watch 23. I can't believe they let you play. Can't believe they even let you play. Red two. Go. Up, up, up. And he carries the ball for a nice game. Gaining four yards. Four yards. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that makes, makes it first and ten. Tight, guys, double tight. Three down, three down. Three down, three down. Watch 14, watch 14. Go. Kill, kill, kill. Gunner three. Now he's scrambling. And they make the stop around the 49-yard line. From their own 49-yard line, second down. Right two. That'll be a seven-yard pickup. Good decision here. Nice dump off. It's only seven yards, but the offense will take that play every time. It's third down, and they're about two yards shy of the sticks. And this crowd is going absolutely crazy. Wide open, he drops it. Level at 
the 39. That's good for a gain of five yards. From the 39-yard line, it's first down. Five guys will be out in the pattern as they're in the shotgun. Fires quickly, and he's got his man. Tackle around the 30-yard line. I think it was a great play call, and it was very well executed. Any coach would be happy with that kind of outcome on a first or second down play. South Carolina is up a field goal. And down he goes at the 23. Number 13 on the tackle at the 23. First and 10. Ball on the 23. Throws it out there. That was a nice play. Anything you can do without being penalized to prevent the offense from moving forward is always a plus. Tenth play of the drive. And they've got the dime package in there to try and deal with this five receiver look. Scrambling around. The ball is loose. And the offense picks it up. South Carolina is going to have to use their second time out of the hat. First down, and they've got their eyes on that goal line. He's on the run. Good tackle there in space. Kill, kill, kill. That brings him second and goal. Go four. Three, nine. Three, nine. Go. He's scrambling. Missed tackle. Touchdown, Gamecocks. And he tacks on the extra point. It was a 12-play, 65-yard drive, and they get it in for seven. Brad, I thought that was a textbook drive. I thought they did a really good job of showing balance, mixing the play calling with the run and the pass. Just an overall well-executed touchdown drive. And they can forget about returning this one. Well, it's always fun to be part of a defensive battle, and that's certainly what we have right now. Yeah, give credit to both of these defenses. I mean, they, they're playing with a lot of energy, and I think they're doing a nice job up front at the line of scrimmage. And, at this point, they're not giving this either of these offenses a chance to make a play. Well, you know the offense would like to generate more than they did on their last possession. Here's the throw. I don't think he got anything on that. Nothing going on that play. Well, here I think the quarterback needs to be a little bit more patient in the pocket. That way he can allow his receivers to get downfield a little bit before he throws it. From their own 28-yard line. It's second down. Check back 11, check back 11. Black five, black five. Red seven, red seven. And he can't get away from the pressure. We're halfway through, and it's been a good one. 10-0, South Carolina. Glad to have you with us in the studio for the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Reese Davis and David Pollock here completely locked in on that first half. We've seen both of these offenses be able to produce big plays in the past. But not in the first half of this game. Defense has done a very good job limiting the explosive play. And most offenses, you know, live and die by the big plays. And I said it because most of them aren't patient enough to just sit there and take the three yard, four yard, five yards at a time. They'll take it a couple times. They'll take it three times. But then they got to go up top and make that big play and hit that home run. And so when, you, when you're a defensive guy and you can make them earn it and go the length of the field and become patient, and then wait for them to make that one mistake. I think you're always going to find yourself in a better position. So great job in the first half, limiting the big plays and making the offenses hurt everything that they've got. That's going to do it for David and me here in the studio. Time to get you back to the game. Red and Kirk ready to take you home in the second half. And we welcome you back to the action here. Just about set for the second half. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one.
So they're just about set to get the game going again. Backs got it on the quick throw. They'll bring him down around the 37 yard line. That makes it from their own 37 yard line. First down. He's going to try and scramble. Quarterback's going to run it, and he's got room to work. And he got about six on that little scramble. They're about four yards away here on second down. Now he tries to buy some time. Excellent open field tackle. Three, maybe four yards on the scramble. That'll bring up third and inches. He's taken down at the 46-yard line. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 46-yard line. That brings him second and five. Pin the mirrors back and go full strength. Red two. Pitches back. He's knocked out of bounds around the 35-yard line. Call it a gain of six yards. First down from the 35-yard line. First down. Three down. Three down. Mike check. 33. 33. Dog four. Green. And he's tackled at the 28. Game of seven on the play. That'll bring up second. Here's the eighth play of the series. Three down, three down. Hey, check Mike 33. Check Mike 33. Gets to about the 27 yard line. The halfback picks up a yard. That was the junior linebacker who'll get credit with the tackle there. So we're looking at another third down here. Well, that's the second time that this defense has given up a first down on third down. You work so hard as a defense to get an offense to third down. When you get them there, you've got to be able to have somebody step up and make a big play. Whether it's a defensive tackle slipping through a block, a linebacker shooting a gap, a defender in the secondary that's able to make a play on a football. Somebody's got to make a play, and that's what winning is. The difference between winning a football game and losing is how you play on third down. It's the 11th play of the drive. Three down, three down. Mike Sick, 33, 33. Black five. Nice run, and he's brought down. That's good for a gain of seven yards. First and goal from the five. They're knocking on the door. Red two. There's a strike complete. Tackle made at the five yard line. That brings him second and goal. And this is the 13th play of this drive. Three down, three down. Hey, check Mike 33. Check Mike 33. Green nine, green. Touchdown, South Carolina. A powerful push by the line and a really nice run. That'll get you into the end zone almost every time. And he converts the extra point. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. He really got a hold of that kick. 
And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The Gamecocks continue to get it done on the defensive side of the football, Kirk. Yeah, they've done a good job of building this lead and almost determined here to protect it. Let's see if they can hold on here for the rest of the way. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. He gets out to about the 28-yard line. That's how we do, D. That's, That's how we do. They don't want none of this. They don't want none of this. That'll, That'll make it second and seven. seven. From their own 28-yard line. Second down. Four down, four down. Hey, check, check back 11, check back 11. Red, two, green, 15. Motion, motion, motion. Pulls it in, first down, and he's knocked out of bounds. A quarterback's best friend is a receiver he can count on to catch the ball every time he drops back to pass. Gets it out quickly. He's taken down at the 46. Second and six. Ball on the 46 yard line. He makes it to the 48 yard line. Empty backfield, quarterback in the gun. Five wide receivers. He's tackled at the 45. So at the end of three, the Gamecocks in front, 17-0. into the fourth quarter now, and we're back to the action. Check 83, ball going to 83. The defense has got some of their best pass defenders on the field. They set up in the dime to counter that five wide receiver set. Makes the catch, and he might take it. Touchdown, big play. Makes the PAT. Looks like they're ready for the kick. And he got all of this one. Great kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Both teams are well aware that a score on this drive is going to create an almost insurmountable lead. This defense has really got to step it up and make a stop. And a quick throw. Brought down right around the 26-yard line. That's good for a gain of one yard. That brings up second and nine. From their own 26-yard line, it's second down. They come out on an empty backfield. Go! He scrambled, decides to tuck it in, and he's got space. Hey, sometimes the defense does everything right, and they still lose. That time they had tight coverage, which left no options other than for the quarterback to take off. Tighten up, tighten up. Pull together. Dog four! Gains his way to midfield, so he keeps it, and he gets a big first down. The quarterback made a very good decision here not to pitch. He saw a break in the defense and just hit it for a big game. Black five, it's first and ten. Five. Ball on the 50-yard line. Now he's going to run and watch out. Well, they didn't get the first down, but it was still a pretty good run by the quarterback. He made a good decision to take off there. Come 
Mic check, 33. 33. Hey, let's get that ball, dude. Let's get that ball right here. Here we go, here we go, here we go. That makes four sacks today. Well, this speed is difficult to defend because you have to try to keep them off balance so they can't use their quickness. Third down, and they need to get it inside the 40. Black five, go! Caught, open field. And they make the stop at the 40. Brad, it's a, it's a first down. And, and a, obviously, this offense right now is trying to maintain possession, trying to get some rhythm going. And for them to be able to pick up a big first down right here allows them to continue to try to get to the position that they ultimately want to get. That's into the end zone. And they get him in the backfield for a loss. This is the eighth play of this drive. Just over two minutes in the game. Red two, three, 15. 22, 22. Gets to about the 37-yard line. The back hits three on the carry. We have two minutes left to play in this game. Alabama will take their first time out of the half. Black five. He gets sacked on the play. The protection broke down. The defense was in the backfield in a hurry, and they brought the quarterback down. Nice play. Right now, he wants to get this kick away and change field position. He really got a hold of that one. This punt goes over the goal line, and this will be a touchback. So we're just about ready to return to action. Three down, three down. Hey, check, check Mike 11, check Mike 11. Down, blue nine. Quick throw. Pretty nice pick up here. These guys are getting very tight on their timing. And he stops the clock with a spike. From their own 24-yard line. Third down. Three down, three down. Hey, check, check Mike 11, check Mike 11. Red! He lets it fly. He goes up and gets it. And he hits it hard at the 28-yard line. I'm telling you right now, when you have that kind of speed, you are a real threat to go all the way. So that could have been even worse for this defense. Red two, blue four, blue. Easy, easy. And he just gets rid of it. You know, when you feel pressure like that, the worst thing you want to do is just to throw the ball into coverage. He got away with one right there. He's very fortunate. Next time, he should just throw it away out of bounds. There are five wide receivers split out. The quarterback in the gun. Finds his man, and they take him down immediately. Third down now, and they need to get it to the 18. Four down, four down. Hey, check, check my a little over a minute in the game. Here we go, here we go. And he tackles him hard at the 32-yard line. But the defense is fired up, responding and reacting to that sack. Not only do they get the quarterback, but they hit him and hit him hard. I think that can really create some confidence for this defense. The next time this quarterback drops back to throw, check, you got to be check. thinking he's going to be a little bit gun shy and concerned about the pressure that these defense is putting on him. Go. Quick toss. Stays in bounds to make a nice catch. And this is the eighth play of the drive. The sub package in there defensively in this five wide receiver set. He passes it. Good job here by the defense. If you let this quarterback set and throw, he'll kill you all game. But they got excellent pressure on that play. Second and ten. Ball on the 13 yard line. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Great pressure on the quarterback forced that incompletion. Boy, they really pounded him on that throw. This is the 10th play of this drive. Let's bring it. Let's go, let's bring it. 
Let's bring it. Hey, check. Dog four. Go. That's a great tackle at the 20. Kill, kill. So the play of the day, fourth and ball game, and the defense comes up with the stop of the day and what will be the win. The offense is looking to be a little bit more successful with this drive as they had to punt the ball away the last time they had it. Tackle around the 15-yard line. The running back gets two on the carry. Alabama's out of timeouts. And this should be a kneel down as they just try to kill the clock. And the quarterback's going to take a knee to drain this clock and any hopes the opposition may have had. And that's the end of the ball game and our final score in this one, 17-7, Gamecock. The Crimson Tide. That's it for this presentation of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk Kirk Street, I'm Brad Nessler saying thanks, and we'll see you soon.